All right, the change in weather is in full force, and I can tell you that we are hearing and seeing a lot of sniffling and coughing here at the station. And one thing we know, did you hear that? One thing we know is that a lot of healthcare providers stress, go get the flu shot. Rihanna Fajarin is here. You're a pharmacist with the Walgreens over off of Rio Grande and Central. You're here to talk to us about the flu shot. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Okay, so in case you didn't know, there are different types of flu shots, right? Talk to us about that. Yes, there is a wide range of flu shots that we all offer. You have your standard, you have your quadrivalent, which has the four strands in it. Okay. We also have a, a high dose flu shot, which is for anyone over the age of 65. We have preservative free flu shot. We have flu shot available hmm. for anyone who has egg allergies. Interesting. I didn't know that. We also carry a flu mist, which is a My son got that. Yeah, nasal shot for the people who are screaming with needles. Oh, wow. So does one need to know about the different type of flu shots, or is that what you do when you consult with them and you kind of figure out what flu shot is best for them? Exactly. Okay. Exactly. And the CDC recommends or has no preference between one flu vaccine versus another flu vaccine. Okay, okay. So in all honesty, the wrong shot is no shot. Ah, there you go. And is it too late to go get the flu shot or is it, are we just right on time? No, actually this is perfect timing. The flu season can extend all the way up until May. Uh, last year alone, oh, wow. okay. the peak of the flu season was in October and again in January. Okay. But the flu vaccine protects you for several months, even up to a full year. So getting it now will have you covered all the way through. Yeah, you know, I've heard some people are a little scared to get the flu shot. Not our Matt really? Mara, though. Really? You just happened to hear that, did you? You know, he is actually, you're going to get the flu shot. Uh, right uh, here, live so they the say, air. yes. I was coaxed into this. All right. All right. For the record. Rihanna's going to show us how easy uh, it is. How's right. this going to hurt? I hate shots. <laughs> Let's see. She's doing a little sterilizing. Okay, here's the deal. I signed my life away earlier this morning, all right? Yep. <laughs> Insurance paying for this because it's preventative medicine, right? Okay. All right. Oh, great. Exactly. Okay. Well, like your flu shots in the past, you may mm -hmm. notice a little bit of tenderness. It's ah. going to feel like you've been working out with the muscle a little oh, bit. Oh, I do that a lot. Yeah. yeah. That's it. Okay, that's, that's it. it. That's it. How'd it feel? Done? Uh, it, yeah, it didn't hurt. A little poke. I'm a big boy. It's a yeah. little poke. It's a little poke. And it's you good. said, and most, yeah, most yeah. insurances now, is any... cover flu yeah, shot. Yeah, That's yeah, important yeah. to mention, yeah, right? Up to 90% of insurances do cover the flu shot. If not, come in. We'll take a look at your insurance. Uh, cash price is not that much. It's only about $30. Oh, so ah, there you go. You, you know what? I, what about, you know, a lot of people think that you get sick after you yes, get the flu shot. Yes, good question, what yeah. What do you tell them? I, I'm feeling a little woozy right oh, now. Oh, jeez. No excuse to call in. <laughs> Don't call Actually, in sick. the flu shot is an inactivated virus. So okay. the chances from getting sick from it are very nil to even none. There you go. No. That's a myth. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. Very good information. Thank you so much for coming in. Yeah. Matt, very brave. All right. See you on Took Monday. Took a needle in the, in the arm. Yeah. <laughs> Don't yeah. call Took it sick. Took one for the team. <laughs> no, now that you have the flu shot, you will not get sick. <laughs> Darn. No, I can't use that excuse later. <laughs> Time huh? right now is 747. All right. Coming up in a little bit, we are talking about snowshoeing this winter. Have you ever done snowshoeing? No. It's, it's interesting, exciting. right? Never done it. We're going to learn all about it coming up right here on Tucasa this morning. You've done it.